Don't just a boy. Turn it up, turn it up. Turn it up, turn it up, yeah. Turn it up, turn it up. Turn it up, turn it up, yeah. She needs. Get less, she needs. In this recipe, we need goat milk. Goat milk is great for hydrating the skin. It can exfoliate your skin. It is great for sunburn. Uh, it is also good for sensitive and irritated skin. This can add moisture into your skin. I can go on and on with this. The next ingredient we need is oat milk. Oat milk is rich in vitamins, minerals, and antioxidants. This can help reduce skin inflammation. It can help uh, smoothen your skin. It is great for dry and rough skin. It can help uh, gently exfoliate your skin and also condition and nourish your skin as well. But please guys, try and buy organic oat milk the so the next ingredient we need is honey honey is very uh, moisturizing for the skin it can act as a pus cleanser this is very useful for sunburn it can hydrate your skin it can help reduce uh, wrinkles it can add glow into your skin it can reverse aging this can fight acne and pimples as well but please guys buy organic <laughs> So the next ingredient we need is apple. Most people don't know this. Apple is packed with AHAs. This can gently exfoliate your skin. This can also hold moisture into your skin. This can also help to create a barrier on your skin that causes you to have water loss without clogging your pores. So this is the way to go, guys. But please buy organic, organic, organic. Don't go for anything else. Organic is the best. Now the next ingredient we need is lemon. Lemon is very great for the skin. It is packed with vitamins, citric acid. This can lighten up your skin naturally. Great for treating melasma and also blackheads, eczema. I can go on and on with these guys. You will need a mixing bowl, a measuring spoon and also a spoon to stir. Please guys, make sure they are super clean. Yes. <laughs> so the next thing we want to do is to add one tablespoon of the oatmeal into the mixing bowl. One teaspoon of the powder milk. If you don't have a powder milk, you can use any milk of your choice. But please make sure it is milk, nothing else added into it, just raw milk. Now the next thing we want to do is to put a teaspoon of the manuka honey in there. Like I said, guys, you want to make sure that they are all organic, 100% organic, so you can get all the benefits of your scrub. Yes, that's what you need to do. Um, you guys, please wait till the end of this video because I need to show you guys the results once I'm done applying it on my face. Uh, the next thing we want to put is the lemon juice. One teaspoon of the lemon juice. You don't want to go overboard. Please don't add too much. Just a little quantity will be fine. You don't need too much of that in there. Just one teaspoon will be okay. Now the next thing I want to do is to douse my um, apples into smaller pieces. Just so that I can be able to blend them. Or blend it I would say <laughs> now if you have a stick blender it's okay if you have mortar if you have ordinary blender just something to uh, use so you can get the smooth uh, paste consistency yeah so just take your time slice them into smaller pieces okay now I am going to use my mortar and this process would take a little long, not too much, maybe less than five minutes, I would say. The next thing I want to do right now is to match my apples. And um, the reason why I am using the mortar is because I want to get a fine, smooth consistency. We are going to be using everything here today. Nothing will be thrown away. Uh, once you are done matching or blending, all you need to do is to add it into your mixing bowl. And then stir it. Make sure they are properly mixed. Everything mixed together. 
Yeah. And I will advise you to leave it to sit for like 10 minutes so that the oatmeal will soak really well. I was in a hurry and I didn't wait. So don't make the same mistake that I did. Otherwise, they'll be falling off your face. Yeah. So right now I'm going to demonstrate, but the first thing you need to do, make sure your hands are super clean. Before you touch your face, make sure all the time that your hands are clean. Now you want to gently uh, scrub your face in a circular motion. Yeah, this is my mistake. I was doing this in my kitchen. <laughs> I made a mess, guys. Don't do the same mistakes, please. And like I said, you need to wait for like 10 minutes before you apply it on your face. Otherwise, they'll be falling off your face. Like as you can see right now, they are falling off my face, which is not a good thing at all. I was in a hurry. So um, all you need to do from now is to um, just gently massage it all over your face in a circular motion. Once you're done, try to put them on your face. Let the... Let the mixture sit on your face so that it can really work. And this process can take 10 to 15 minutes. So once you're done applying it on your face, the next thing you want to do is to allow it to sit for at least 15 to 20 minutes more. Now, this process you can't do every day, at least once in a week or twice in a month, depending on your case. If your skin is very rough and you really want to work on your skin, then I would suggest you do it once every week. Then when you start to see improvements, please reduce it to twice in a month. Okay, guys, or maybe once in a month as well, because I do this once in a month because this is deep cleansing. This can cleanse your pores, take out all the impurity that you have on your skin. Well, I'm sorry, guys, you have to watch me sing and dance <laughs> because that's what I do whenever I apply my marks on my face. I always sing and dance. So enjoy. <laughs> So for those of you that wants to see what my face looks like without a makeup, woohoo! Now you can see it. <laughs> oh my god! I don't know how to dance, guys. Please do not laugh at me. Okay, so I'm just whiling away time, waiting for it to cook. I would say, on my face, this is like the best of the best. Uh, facial scrub natural facial scrub that you can ever do and i'm assuring you guys once you do this come back leave me a comment tell me your testimony i want to hear the results my channel is all about the results and not just blabbing around okay <laughs> okay i'm just trying to kiss you guys i hope you get the kiss from me to you <laughs> I'm sorry guys, I'm being naughty. It's allowed, it's allowed. It's a woman thing, so oh my word. <laughs> so uh I'm just trying to while away time because I need this to sit on my face for at least 20 minutes. And I want you guys to see this process. Please do not go away. You need to see the result. And um, yeah, for those of you that think I have a perfect skin, I don't have a perfect skin. That's why there are people like me and people out there who are trying to do stuff on their face on a daily basis just to get a good, clear skin. So if you really want to work on your skin, then you have to focus more on what you do. Consistency, patient is the key. You don't want to give up. Now, um, in this process, all you need to do now is to start uh, scrubbing your face. But you have to be gentle. You need to go on a circular motion around your face. Don't be aggressive. Please, guys, you need to go like really gentle on your face in a circular motion. So this process would take at least five or uh, six to seven minutes. Yeah, depending on your skin, I would say. My skin is not sensitive. I can handle it. It's not painful. They are all natural products, so you don't have to be scared. But just 
take your time and make sure you do the deep cleansing on your face. You will enjoy it. I promise you. <laughs> so that's all you need to do. Now, the next thing you want to do, if you have a, a washcloth, you can use warm water to uh, wipe away the residue on your face or you can use lukewarm water to wash your face afterwards depending on what you want to do i used a washcloth with a warm water and i wiped my face and you would see the result after now so this is the result this is what my face looks like right now i'm not applying anything no moisturizer you can see the glow instantly on my skin and it's so amazing. Like I said, you can do this depending on your case, either once or twice in a month. So guys, if you like my video, please give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, please do so. Don't forget to hit on the notification bell as well so that you'll be notified each time I upload a new video. Like I will always say, if it doesn't feed you, do not water it. I love you guys.